This video is for the pros, the legends among legends, the ultimate weeb lords who've seen it all. We've carefully cherry-picked and curated the best of underrated anime gems that even pro otakus like you guys might have missed. This is Dan. And I'm Lisa, and we're here to count down the top 10 shows for pro anime fans who feel like they've watched it all. But before that, don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more anime recommendations like this, because we've got dozens of more underrated top 10s coming up, and I'm sure you're gonna love them. Kicking things off at number 10 is Tokyo ESP. This is the story of a normal girl whose life gets thrown into chaos when she starts seeing a penguin and a school of goldfish flying around in the sky. And nope, she's not high. When one such goldfish passes through her body, she gets the supernatural ability to phase through matter. Yep, that's Lady Mirio right there. Now, what would a normal teenage girl do when she gets supernatural powers? Become a superhero, of course. This story is about her fighting criminals and other evil villains who have gained superpowers just like her. Next up on our list is Ikebukuro Westgate Park, an underrated anime about the lawless side of Tokyo. This story is about a guy who is pretty much the messenger of peace, who goes around resolving the conflicts between rival gangs in town. But things get crazy when a new faction called the Red Angels occupy the turf of the infamous G-Boys. Things escalate real quick, with the gang members going at each other's throats and almost murdering each other. Now it is up to our MC to figure out a way to stop the gang war and save dozens of lives. また at number 8 on our list is Rewrite, a somewhat old and outdated anime that has been long forgotten by fans and haters alike. To be honest, it had more haters than fans, but hey, I'm telling you, it's actually not as bad as they claim. The story is about a boy who has the ability to permanently rewrite any aspect of his body. With this overpowered ability, he can easily give himself superhuman speed and strength just like that. Being kind of a freak himself, he gets drawn to other supernatural entities in his school as he joins the occult club, where he uncovers the secrets of his new club members and a dark fate that only he can rewrite. With a total of two seasons, it is the perfect show to binge this weekend. <laughs> Coming up next is this controversial anime called Blade and Soul. For those who've played the original video game, this anime was a total disaster. But for those who've never heard of it, this anime was actually a pretty good watch. This story is about a lone assassin and her quest for revenge. But along the way, she meets other people who have ties with her slain master, and she has to fight her way out as she embarks on a journey to find her soul. While the anime is nothing extraordinary, it is still a decent watch considering this is one of the very few anime focusing on a female main character. Huh? 
待って待って待って待って待って待って見てただけ見てただけっす殺したんですか殺しちゃいねえよ俺はただ動けなくしただけ殺すのは墓守の仕事だ At number six on our list is one of my personal favorites, Sunday Without God. This anime takes you on an unforgettable journey as you follow along the story of a lonely little girl who lives in a world that is abandoned by the gods. As the only surviving gravekeeper in town, her job is to bury the dead and save their souls from becoming undead. With a cast of well-written characters and unique plot points, the only drawback is its outdated visuals. Other than that, it is a brilliant show that is totally worth watching. But fair warning guys, this anime is so full of emotion that it might even make you cry. That said, at the end of it all, I assure you that you will thank me for recommending this show. It is that good. <laughs> ま、通ってことねえよ。じゃあ行くか。え。全員逃げろ。ヘルメットを解除したやつは、かぶれ。Next up at number 5 is Astra Lost in Space, an anime that I'm sure will blow your mind with its insane plot twists. This is an award-winning series set in a futuristic world where interplanetary space travel is normal. Our main character, Kanata, is an athletic person who is about to go on an excursion to another planet with a group of other teenage travelers. But the worst possible thing happens as their group is sucked into a strange black hole that teleports them into deep space. Now, the group has to survive all on their own and find a way back home. This is not the entire story, you guys, but revealing any more detail would be a spoiler, so we're not gonna do that. あれズボン君らはまだ誰も気づいていないがこの学園にいや全人類に危機が迫っているんだだから僕が出てきたんだ Coming up next is yet another personal favorite of mine called Boogie Pop and Others. This is an anime about a girl who is your average high school student by day and a supernatural guardian entity by night. The best part? The girl is not even aware of her alter ego's existence. The entire story is pretty much about Boogie Pop fighting otherworldly monsters one after another, protecting people from a threat they cannot see. But the storytelling and visuals are so brilliant that you can't help but fall in love with it. That said, this anime is certainly not for everyone. I know Sinan fans are gonna love this, but Shonen fans, I'm not so sure. ない。もう信じらんないよ、この馬鹿鬼。もう帰る。ああ。行き。
時まで送ってくれるとかしてよ出かけたくないだって最近この辺り物騒じゃんかそうだねバカバカバカ鬼こそ猟奇的な犯人のばったりあっちゃえ At number three on our list is this anime called Chaos Head, written by the same creator as the popular Steins Gate series. But I'm gonna be honest, guys, while it is good in its own right, it is definitely not on par with Steins Gate. This story is about a carefree otaku who spends all his time playing games and watching anime. However, his ordinary life comes to a crashing end when he gets caught up in a series of brutal murders. One day, an unknown user on the internet sends him an image of a man staked to a wall. Later, he sees the same incident happen in real life right in front of his eyes. Having caught the attention of evil people, he finds secrets about himself and the world, all the while having to survive and fight the killers along with his newfound friends. ちょっと何すかあれ。どうよ、お前。一体何考えて。公務執行妨害で逮捕する。勘弁大介。Runner up at number two is The Millionaire Detective Balance Unlimited. This is probably the most popular anime among all the other shows we've mentioned on this list, and for a good reason. This anime offers a fresh new outlook on a detective story, teaming up a regular, justice loving police detective with a millionaire who uses his infinitely deep pockets for solving criminal cases. Watching these two detectives with polar opposite personalities go at it is simply hilarious. With a ton of comedy and a few heartwarming scenes, the millionaire detective totally deserves all the fame it gets. Finally, at the number one spot on our list is Nobunaga Concerto, a super underrated anime series that literally nobody knows about. While the series is somewhat popular in Japan, the rest of the world is completely sleeping on it. This is a one-of-a-kind isekai anime about a laid-back and carefree high school boy who gets transported into the Edo period of Japan. There, he is forced into playing the role of Oda Nobunaga, the legendary historical figure who united the country through countless wars and bloodshed. Except, the uniting nation part has not happened yet and our MC has to take care of it, even though he knows next to nothing about wars and strategies. Equipped with modern knowledge and his history book from school, he has to navigate his new life and succeed as the infamous emperor that dominates the warring states period of Japan. ごちゃごちゃとうるさいな。お前、自分が何しようとしてるのか分かってんのか。信長を殺したら今まで習ってきた歴史が変わっちゃうんだぞ。だからこんなとこで殺されちゃいけないんだ。信長は天下を取る男だぞ!
There we go, guys. These are the top 10 super underrated anime shows that not a lot of people know about, which are perfect for pro weebs like yourself to watch. But hey, we're not done yet. If this video gets 300 likes, we'll post the second part of this video, which will have even more underrated gems that nobody knows about. Until then, stay tuned and have a fun day.